How you doing? This is Steven, otherwise known as HashGuide from TheCryptoist.com and in this video I'm going to show you guys how you can verify your smart contracts on the Binance Smart Chain using Truffle without ever leaving your terminal. So let's begin. Uh, this is the website for Truffle Suite. Uh, it's TruffleSuite.com and they have this plugin that you can use where you type a command into the terminal and bam your contract is verified. No need to worry about the bytecode or ABI encoded constructor arguments, or anything like that. So the first thing you want to do, um, if you have a project already established and you want to go ahead and do it, let's move on to our truffleconfig.js. All right, I'm not gonna go over the whole coding in this video, but uh, I'm gonna be releasing the whole code along. Uh, in the next next couple of days for a more advanced ERC20 token deployment and uh, smart contract verification all in one video. Uh, sometimes it's easier to see how it's done and you know the issues you can run into and how to solve them and so on. But for now, I'm just gonna give it all a quick uh, explain and show you how the complete process, uh, how the the end process works out. All right, so. To include this plugin in your um, truffleconfig.js, you need to add under the module exports a plugins uh, array with the truffle plugin verify. But first, make sure you're in your root directory and use either npm or yarn, and you can yarn add. It's a dev dependency. Uh, you can just type it in like that and it will add it to your project and then you just add plugins right here okay now you're gonna need to go to bscscan.com and sign up for an account and then you need to create an API key so basically it's bscscan.com slash my API or, or something to that lines but um once you go there you create an account you create an API key and then you create uh, either a .n file and you use .n npm package to include environment var uh, variables or you can use a JSON file like I am and just include the, the API key through this way and also you know we're not talking about actual smart contract development but um, you know we can include a mnemonic seed and the testnet RPC you know you know a any environment variable that we need um, can be used from an uh, JSON file as well as a dot n file with dot n npm package all right so after you get the plugins set up and your API key you gotta get the API keys uh, object right here for BSC scan all right and that is pretty much it now I'm gonna deploy this project one more time just so I can show you guys real quick. So, just give it a second to compile and deploy with my new uh, contract address, and I will show you guys how quick it is to verify smart contracts without ever leaving your terminal or IDE. And also, please, if you guys watch my videos and they ever help you at all, if you ever get any useful information from my videos, please make sure you smash that subscribe button right now. Hit it right at the below. You can, you can pause this video, hit that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up, leave a comment. Let me know what I can improve on, uh, what kind of videos you guys would like to see. And also, if you could share my channel to anyone wanting to learn how to develop smart contracts or learn how to use crypto in general, um, I, that'd be greatly appreciated. I'm trying to build my channel up. I wish I could put more time into it and better videos and better, you know, publishing. But uh, I'm doing the best I can with the time I have. All right. So just give this another second, and we're down to the last example. 
So I'm going to copy this contract address right here. Actually, we don't need that. Um, if you look at the documentation about the Truffle uh, Verify plugin, it kind of says to you know give the contract name at symbol to separate the contract name and address. But I learned that you using it without the address, uh, it, it works. Uh, in some uh, certain situations, you may need to include the address with it, but in this one, we don't need to. So the command we're gonna type is, um, and by the way, I'm, I'm typing MPX truffle instead of truffle because um, I've been installing truffle per each project lately, and NPX will execute uh, a library that is in the node modules folder. Okay, so what we have here is Truffle Run, uh, which is going to be running a plugin. Verify is the, the name of the plugin, and the cryptos.com DAP token is the name of the smart contract that we deployed to the network BSC test. Now, this network BSC test is going to be whatever you have in your network section in the Truffle config. And this should only take a few seconds. And this beats trying to argue with your, your ABI instruct, uh, encoded constructor arguments and everything like that and it not being correct. Uh, this is so much easier. So please make sure if you want to see how this is implemented completely from start to beginning, uh, start to end, please make sure you smash the subscribe button right now. Hit that thumbs up, leave a comment, and don't forget to share this to any commu crypto community that you think this can uh, be a useful to. All right. I appreciate you watching. Have a good day.